I know I usually start the day by making my bed, but I'm taking the sheets off my bed right now because today is a self-care day and I can't really think of anything that feels better than laying in bed at night in clean sheets. It just is the greatest feeling. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another vlog. In today's vlog, I am doing a self-care day here at home. I just feel like this is very much needed for me right now. It's cold and rainy and gray outside. My favorite thing to do on days like that is to stay inside and just do some things that will make me happy, will benefit me mentally. And that's what we're gonna be doing today. I'm really, really excited for this. Like I said, I feel like I need this right now. My definition of self-care is very broad. I really just see it as anything that makes you happy or benefits you in some way, mentally, physically. Even the most seemingly mundane and smallest things I consider self-care. Like honestly, anything can be self-care. I made coffee this morning. That is a form of self-care for me. I love my coffee recipe so much. I think that for me, it's the act of making the coffee, doing all the steps with my espresso machine and putting it all together. I like to listen to a podcast while I do my whole morning routine. So while I was making my breakfast and while I was making my coffee, I was listening to a podcast. I really enjoy doing that. I think also listening to a podcast is a form of self-care. Like that's what I mean when I say the smallest things all are self-care for me. I need to stop saying the phrase self-care. I know that's what this video is about, but it is going to get maddeningly annoying if I continue on saying as much as I have in the past five minutes. I don't really think that anything that I'm gonna be doing today is exciting, but it's all going to make me feel better. So that's really what matters. Let this be a reminder to you that you deserve to take care of yourself in whatever way that is for you. Self-care looks different for everybody and everybody has different things that just genuinely bring them joy or make them feel, you know, more at ease mentally. Even the smallest things that you don't even really consider as self-care that are actually like the best forms of self-care for yourself. Before we get started with the day though, I want to thank the sponsor of today's video, which is ThreadUp once again. I've worked with ThreadUp so much and I love them. I will continue talking about them forever. Hope that's okay with you guys. If you're not familiar with ThreadUp, they are an online thrift and consignment store. They have over 35,000 brands on there at up to 90% off of estimated retail prices. For me, thrift shopping is truly another form of self-care. This is what I mean. Like it can literally be anything. I love thrifting. I have been going to thrift stores and consignment stores for honestly as long as I can remember. Ever since I was a kid, I would go with my mom. It feels like a treasure hunt to me when I go thrifting and I just, the feeling of finding a like hidden unique gem of clothing it's such a fun thing. It's a good feeling and it's great for the environment. Charlie loves thrifting. Charlie loves thrifting. Yes, she does. I've gotten some new pieces recently from ThreadUp. I want to show you them, so let's do a little haul. The first thing that I got is actually something I'm wearing right now, and it is this black turtleneck. It's actually a short sleeve t-shirt. I am obsessed with turtlenecks. This really doesn't even need to be said at this point. I feel like I am always wearing turtlenecks. They are so amazing for layering. Nine times out of 10, when I put together an outfit, a turtleneck is involved somehow. This one is from Ralph Lauren. The estimated retail price of this was $48, and I got it from ThreadUp for 
for only $15.99. It's amazing quality. It feels brand new, honestly, and I'm obsessed with it, and I'm gonna be wearing it a ton. The next thing that I got is a little graphic t-shirt. It's this one, and it's from Levi's. I just think that this is so cute. It's stylish, it feels vintage to me, and also I love wearing black. Do I need to say that? I gravitate mostly towards wearing neutrals, so this just being black and white is perfect. I can wear this with so many different outfits and I'm really excited about it. The estimated retail on this was $36 and I got it from ThreadUp for $17.99. I talked about this a couple videos ago, but I have been getting back into a workout routine. So I picked up this little workout top. ThreadUp is an amazing place to go for workout clothes. I've gotten a few things from there now that I like to wear to the gym. There's so many. This one's from Lululemon. They have a ton of Lulu stuff. They have aloe, so many good workout brands. So definitely check them out if you're in the market for some new workout clothes. The estimated retail on this tank was $48 and I got it from ThreadUp for $23.99. All right, two more things. Next, I got this vest. This just feels so me. I am obsessed with it. It's from North Face. It's so cool. It's so cool. I've been getting back into vests lately a lot. Again, I think they're perfect for layering. I love layering. This was originally $71 and I got it from ThreadUp for $30.99. Finally, I think this is my favorite thing that I got and also my favorite deal that I got. Oh my gosh, you guys. I got this amazing blazer. This literally looks and feels brand new. Like it literally looks like it has never been worn. And the kicker for me is that it's from Babaton which is a brand that is sold at Aritzia. It's something that feels illegal, but it's not that I discovered how to find clothes from Aritzia on ThreadUp. I am obsessed with jackets, blazers, anything of the sort. You guys know this at this point. I'm always throwing a jacket over everything. No outfit is complete without a jacket. This blazer was originally $188. I got it from ThreadUp for $43.99. I'm so excited about it. So if you guys wanna check out ThreadUp, you can get up to 60% off of your first purchase and free shipping with my code Hannah. All this information as well as a link to check out ThreadUp's website will be in the description below. So feel free to go and check that out, explore ThreadUp's website and see what amazing things that you guys can find. And again, thank you so much to ThreadUp for sponsoring today's video. My first self-care item of the day is going to be tidying up my apartment. I want to wash my sheets, like I said, and then like make my bed. I also just have shit everywhere right now because I had a very busy past couple of days and I kind of just was like throwing stuff everywhere and never put any of it back, which I hate doing, but I do it more than I care to admit. So I need to clean that stuff up, tidy everything up. And I just think that that's going to make me feel so much better and more motivated to do everything else. Uh, you guys know me well enough at this point to know that if my space is cluttered, it severely impedes my ability to do things. It, my mental health declines when my room and my space is cluttered. There has to be a science behind this. I'm almost positive there's a science behind this, but that's why that's number one on my to-do list today because I feel like once I do that, I'm just gonna feel instantly better. So I'm gonna try and do this in not a ridiculously long amount of time. I'm just gonna get up. We're gonna go do it. We're gonna do it. We're gonna tidy up, get my apartment back together, and we're gonna feel better. Why am I saying we? It's just me.
I love this vacuum more than I love so many other things. This is the Dyson V8 animal, not sponsored, but Dyson, feel free to reach out to me. desperately need to take out the trash and recycling so I'm gonna go do that too that I believe to be a form of self-care is doing things that I've been putting off for no reason. You just keep putting them off and saying, oh, I'll do it this time, I'll do it tomorrow, I'll do it next week. Then it never ends up getting done. Just sitting down or going around or whatever it is that you need to do and doing them, it just makes me feel so much better. And most of the time they're small tasks, but having them build up and having more things added to that list makes it a big task. Okay, just finished doing all of that. Literally took me 10 minutes max. And now I am gonna take a break and go make myself a piece of self-care avocado toast. Just sitting here and thinking about how phenomenal that was i've literally been processing it for the past 20 minutes avocado toast on sourdough is the only combination i don't make the rolls i know that it's kind of random that i would include this next thing that i'm doing as self-care but when i'm in kind of like a creative rut i find it really helpful to try and just brainstorm brain dump some ideas for content so that's what i'm doing right here actually brainstorming some video topics and i'm reading through some of the comments on one of my community posts where i asked you guys if you had any videos that you wanted to see from me specifically so when i do a brainstorm slash brain dump I just write everything that comes to mind. Nothing is stupid. I don't really think twice about it. I just write everything down and then I'll go back over it and kind of pick out the ideas that I like, see which ones are feasible to do by which dates, and then I will schedule them into my planner and it just makes me feel a lot more organized and on top of things. It's a few hours later. I ended up laying down for a little bit because I just felt randomly nauseous So I laid down shut my eyes took a little nap and I feel better. Thank God I also just got a body shower and threw on my pajamas. So I am all ready for the night It is almost seven o'clock right now and the bachelor comes on at eight So I'm gonna call my mom. We like to FaceTime and watch it together. So until then I want to read some of my book. This is another thing that I just think is wonderful for my mental health and is a great like self-care thing to do. I've gotten back into reading in the past like year, year and a half 
and it just makes me so happy. I feel like it's such a nice break from looking at my phone and you know reading stuff on social media and doing all that stuff. Like it really just takes me out of my own world. Obviously that's like the point of reading. It's such a fun activity that does not involve your phone. I am currently reading As Good As Dead by Holly Jackson. This is the third book in the Good Girl's Guide to Murder trilogy. So there's Good Girl's Guide to Murder, Good Girl, Bad Blood, and As Good As Dead. I already started it. I'm on page 102 out of 450-ish. It's so good. So I wanna sit here and read this and then I'm also gonna make something small for dinner, probably just like heat something up. And then we have Bachelor at eight. So until then, let's get it popping. so tired. It's 11 20 p.m. and I am going to bed. I just took my sheets out of the dryer and put them back in my bed so now I have some nice clean fresh sheets to sleep on which just makes me so happy. Wow this lighting is something else. I don't know what else to do. That is going to be the end of today's vlog. Thank you guys so much for coming along with me on this little self-care day. I definitely feel like I did a lot. I don't know if it seems that way, but to me it feels like I did a lot. I definitely feel better than I did at the start of it. But anyway, that's gonna be it for today's vlog. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you liked it. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. If you've stayed until this point in the video, comment down below, I'm a real one because you're a real one. If you wanna see more videos from me, make sure you hit the subscribe button. I post a new video every Sunday. And if you forget that I post a new video every Sunday or you just wanna get notified right when I post a video, make sure you turn on my post notifications for my channel. It's the little bell icon so that you never miss an upload and you get notified right when I post. And again, thank you to ThreadUp for sponsoring today's video. If you guys want to check out ThreadUp, up, you can click the link in my description and use code Hannah to get up to 60% off of your first order and free shipping from ThreadUp. And yeah, I think that's it. I hope you guys all have a wonderful rest of your day and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. <laughs>